So I'm John Mykrantz. I'm the Vice President of Sales for North America for uh, what is our DCCS product line, which entails all of our DAS products. So one of the, the main things that, that we've done, you've heard in, in the news recently, is Comscope acquired TE's wireless, or what, what they call their BNS organization. Um, what that entails is a lot of their DAS products, as well as a larger enterprise position that we've gotten. So with the enterprise portion, which is my direct responsibility, that's what we've really looked at as, as an enhancement to what we're going to bring to the market there. Now we've also recently uh, acquired a company by the name of Irvana, which you've heard of from a, from a small cell standpoint. So as all these customer needs and uh, spaces that are out there, there's so many different variations of solutions that are out there. And so what we've done is, is taken companies that we view that have specific functionalities and specific technologies that can add to our portfolio and, and help ultimately increase the, uh, the options that our, our customers can come back to order from us. Yeah, we're always conscious of that. Uh, what we're trying to do is really remove a lot of the, the additional costs that go into the overall uh, OPEX that's going to be involved with, with uh, our products from the installation, from the design, from the commissioning. Uh, we've got products to where uh, they'll, they'll do auto leveling in there. We've got uh, where there's software configurable. So we're trying to take that upfront aspect to really make sure that when we go out to the customer, we're, we're letting them see the whole picture that it's not just the actual cost of the unit itself. We're trying to remove some of these problems where they don't need to have a, a highly skilled engineer on site all the time. And when you're deploying thousands upon thousands of, of systems, that'll really ultimately save costs down the line for a lot of these customers. It's really, there's so many different customer configurations or applications where, where they can use one or the other. Uh, you know, there's a lot of factors that, that come into play, the space that they've got, what the power levels they're going to need, you know, ultimately cost is going to come in. Really, so it's just assessing each individual opportunity and each individual problem, I guess, if you will, where they need to solve that problem, whether capacity or whether it's, uh, um, you know, anything, anything under the sun that we can address with our products and you try to take all those things into account and really come back with the most optimal solution that we can have for them.